Hello, good people. Uh, this is Ibrahim at Quiet Lawn. Um, I'm the office manager here. Um, I'm sure Mike talked about me uh, in some of the videos uh, he does. Uh, but if you don't know me, uh, let me introduce myself. Uh, again, my name is Ibrahim and I am the manager here at Quiet, Quiet Lawn. I am responsible for basically running the day-to-day -day office operations, um, you know, uh, for Quiet Lawn. Uh, when I say office operations, it's you know, um, including but not limited to uh, receiving phone calls, uh, making phone calls, talking to customers, managing our social media accounts, uh, running our digital marketing campaigns, graphic designing, uh, managing our websites, uh, doing SEO work, um, you know, running payroll, uh, anything that you can think of basically uh, that has to be done from an office environment, uh, we basically take care of it. And what's amazing is that me and my team, uh, I have five people in my team so far, uh, we take care of all this uh, for quite long, all the way from a small country called Bangladesh. Uh, Bangladesh is a country right beside India. It's a very small country. And through the amazing uh, technologies that we have today uh, and the amazing speedy internets we have, uh, we are able to run uh, an entire operation uh, all the way from here. Uh, for quiet long uh, believe it or not uh, quiet long does not have an, any physical office uh, because the entire office is run by us uh, all the way from here and it's amazing uh, because uh, this way we are able to save quite long a lot of money uh, which otherwise would not have been possible if you know quiet long were to hire uh, someone like me or someone uh, you know uh, like my team members uh, over there in the united states uh, so it comes with a lot of cost savings and we do so many great things for quiet long. You would be amazed uh, to see what we do. Uh, but in the next couple of videos, my intention is to show you exactly what we do for quiet long and how we can do the same for you and your business. Uh, so stick around and let's jump into my screen. So this is the app. Uh, this is an app that you can install on your phone, uh, whether that's an Apple iPhone or an Android, uh, you can install it anywhere. Uh, it doesn't require you to publish the app uh, on an app store or anything like that. Uh, what's amazing about this app is you basically can install it uh, from the website. Uh, so it's very easy. Uh, you can also open it uh, on your browser on your desktop PC as well. Uh, wherever you can you know uh, wherever you want to use it uh, once you open the app it looks like this uh, because we want to keep our information safe and secure we don't want people uh, getting access to uh, our quiet long information uh, that could potentially uh, be used against us so i'm going to go ahead and quickly log in uh, using my email so my email is support at quietlong.com if any of you guys want to contact me personally, uh, you can contact me uh, using this email uh, whenever, and I'll try to respond back to you. Uh, I'm going to click on continue. Uh, what this will do is it will send me a pin to my email. I'm going to open my email and enter this pin uh, and then get back to you uh, again in a second. So I have my pin and I'm going to sign in now. So uh, once you open the app, uh, it's very basic. Um, again, I'm not going to go um, in depth uh, of all the features of this app because there's so much in it. I'm going to quickly uh, go over some of the features uh, so that you know what we are doing for Quiet Loan and what we can do for you. Um, for example, uh, there is a clock in and clock out button. Uh, so if you are someone that's uh, facing uh, a tough time, you know, uh, tracking uh, your hours at work or your employees hours at work, uh, this is a feature that we can build in into the app. Uh, you can also see uh, the time check here and you can filter by employees as well and see who's working uh, what hours and what days below the clock in and clock out button we have a bus session so bus session is something we do uh, for quiet long our team members come in every morning uh, we have a small meeting uh, for 10 to 15 minutes where we talk about different things about quiet long some things uh, we follow in quiet longs so for example uh, pay for performance payment method is something uh, to pay our guys uh, here at quiet long and Today's bus session is basically talking about pay for performance, how it works. Some people, they don't want to read the entire text. So what they do is they have the option to listen to it. Play the audio here. It's going to read out whatever is being uh, said here. So uh, we also have a quiz to make sure our employees are paying attention or not. This is a way our manager can take a quiz and you know ask our employees 
uh, what they've learned uh, from today's bus session. On the today's P4P tab, we have a P4P uh, data for the day. So our spring crew one, Paul, uh, if he clicks on it, he can see how much his projected pay is for the day and how much he's gonna earn if, if he's budgeted time uh, or, if, or if he's 10 person faster or if he's 20 person faster or 30 person faster compared to his budgeted time. Uh, they can check their uh, previous data for uh, you know uh, eight hours uh, today, and then he earned a total of twenty-one dollars and seventy-four cents per hour, almost twenty-two dollars per hour. So he did pretty good. Um, they can our employees can come in and check their previous numbers. Uh, there is a lawn care leads section here. Um, again, I won't go into much details, but this is a, this is something that our team members or our office staff regularly use to add new leads and calculate new estimates for them. Uh, what's amazing about this app is it calculates estimates in, within seconds after you enter uh, the required information. So whoever contacts Quiet Lawn, what we do is we enter the information here. So customer name, customer address, phone number, email, uh, where did they hear about us? Uh, did they come from a landing page that we are advertising on? What services they're interested in? Uh, we have two shop locations, so they can choose either one uh, depending on where the lead is coming from. A bunch of other questions that's necessary for us to estimate accurately uh, for the customer. Uh, we enter any additional information that we need to enter and then click on add. Uh, and once you click on add, uh, the app calculates everything automatically uh, from you know uh, the distance from the shop uh, to the address, uh, the mowing uh, price should be, uh, how much our lawn care packages should be, everything is calculated automatically here. And what our office staff does from this point is they just simply plug in this information uh, into uh, one of our portals we use for estimates, and then we send it out to our customers. Uh, we have some data here, uh, you know, uh, again, all of this information is calculated automatically. There is no manual work. Uh, you know, the app calculates uh, the budgeted time it takes, it would take for uh, us to mow this lawn. Uh, it takes into account uh, the distance here as well. So the distance of eight miles of travel, um, you know, the eight miles of travel we have to get through to go to the property and then come back to the shop again. So this time our guys should be getting paid for the travel time. So that time is being considered here as well. Calculates all the prices for mulch uh, on any add-ons as well. Uh, they can add pictures, um, you know, uh, for us to see uh, before we send out the estimate, uh, if there's something we need to look out for, for example. Uh, but yeah, um, once, for example, a customer approves, um, you know, an installation or an estimate, uh, we can even the app even calculates, you know, the details for mulch installation. So uh, you can see the status is approved. Uh, our mulch color that we need to take is brown. Uh, we the amount of bags of mulch we need to take uh, and the budgeted install time. So how many hours are allocated for us to do this install and how many bags we need to take with us uh, for this install. So everything uh, is calculated automatically. So there is no manual work. That's the amazing thing about this app and it saves us so much time uh, and manual work from having to do these estimates manually. And the last but not the least feature I want to show about this app is the KPI, Key Performance Indicator Dashboard. If you see our videos, if you see Mike Mike's videos, uh, he talks about how important it is to make decisions basically by knowing your numbers. Dashboard, we have, you know, the revenue so far, we have uh, gotten from uh, our customers uh, revenue this month uh, value of bookings this year so the amount of work we have booked for the year it's, um, our attrition rate so the number of people cancelling the number of people not responding the number of uh, people accepting our estimates and renewals uh, here's another section uh, that shows uh, some p4p stats uh, this is kind of a way to motivate our employees again uh, to show them who's performing the best. So uh, this is a seven day average of our employee Kevin earning $29 per hour, which is amazing. Uh, we have a picture of the employee of the, you know, the top performer. Uh, so whenever, for example, Paul Fossini takes over, um, you know, Kevin, uh, what happens is 
uh, Paul's image will show up here under top former section automatically. We have a section here that tracks total production so far this year. So how much mowing production we have made, how much garden production we have made. Uh, gardening includes mulch, shrub trimming, stuff like that. Uh, how much production we made for from treatments, lawn treatments and our total production for the for the year uh, we have a section here where which tracks the amount of leads we're getting uh number of leads this month has been you know unusually high normally we range around 40 or 50 but this this month uh we've gotten 79 leads uh this is basically because of the time of the month as well uh, it's march uh you know our grass is slowly coming out of dormancy and we're getting a lot of leads right now uh, which is why the number is high. Um, ad spend, basically what we're spending on uh, on Google, on Facebook, uh, on Instagram, on Nextdoor, and other various other you know marketing channels. And what our lead acquisition cost is. Um, so these are numbers you need to know, and you need to know where your leads are coming from. So for example, we're getting the most amount of leads from Google right now, from Google Search, from Google local ads and there's also a customer acquisition section that you know calculates the uh, acquisition um, or conversion rate basically uh, so of the 79 leads we've got in this month uh, we have converted you know 27 of them our customer acquisition cost is 73 dollars which, which is again very high right now you know the optimal range in our opinion is 50 or 50 dollars uh, per customer uh, but you know anything under hundred dollars is you know a good number if if this number goes above hundred you know you need to look at your marketing again and see where whether you are spending the right way or doing things the right way because uh, if your acquisition cost goes over one hundred dollars uh, you know that's too much and you need to rethink your marketing start strategy Again, that is why this information is very, very useful when it comes to, uh, you know, making decisions. And that is what we are displaying in the app. Again, we have another chart here for conversion sources. Google, no surprise, being the highest uh, when it comes to uh, conversions as well. Uh, so we, we, we know where to spend our marketing money in on Google search ads, on Google local ads, etc. Uh, we have a bunch more service specific data. Uh, so number of mowing customers we have uh, as of right now, uh, the average size of our lawns, uh, you can see uh, 5,300 is the average of all the lawns we have. Our average mowing prices, basically a lot of information that may not make sense to you right now, but makes a lot of sense to us. And then we are able to make very, very important decisions based on this information well thank you guys for sitting through that long video um I, i'm sorry i talked too much maybe uh this is my one of my first videos here and i'm quite nervous uh but you know i hope you guys liked uh the information you saw in this video and like i said uh if you need our help uh you know building something like this please leave a comment down below and we will get in touch with you and uh, over the next few weeks and months, hopefully uh, I can make more content like this and show you exactly what we do for Quiet Lawn and how we do it and how it's helping Quiet Lawn grow and scale exponentially. Uh, again, thank you for staying with me so far. Uh, I hope you liked the content. If you did, please click on the thumbs up button down below and click on the subscribe button as well to stay updated on our next videos. Thank you so much. Have a good day. Bye-bye.